Hello folks and welcome back to Ruthless Metal and in today's video we're going to explore the origins of speed metal and we're going to try to find the roots of the genre so make sure that you guys hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new so you won't miss out on future uploads here on the most ruthless of metal channels. So let's take a deep dive into the speed metal genre now and to do that we need to start with the definition and this is what Wikipedia has to say about speed metal. Speed metal is an extreme subgenre of heavy metal music that originated in the late 1970s from new wave of British heavy metal roots. It's usually considered less abrasive and more melodic than thrash metal, showing less influence from hardcore punk. However, speed metal is usually faster and more aggressive than traditional heavy metal, also showing more inclination to virtuoso soloing and featuring short instrumental passages between couplets. Speed metal songs frequently make use of highly expressive vocals, but are usually less likely to employ harsh vocals than thrash metal songs. So let's kick this video off by listening to some fast hard rock and heavy metal songs of the late 60s and 70s. <laughs> Oh, 
In my opinion, speed and thrash metal had similar origin stories due to both genres being faster versions of traditional heavy metal. And in that Wikipedia article, it was said that speed metal had new wave of British heavy metal roots. So let's listen to some fast new wave of British heavy metal songs from 1980 up until 1982. <laughs> And in my opinion, we've seen several bands recording songs that I would label speed metal. And amongst them were Raven and Venom, but in 1982 and 1983, we saw the first couple of speed metal records being released. And I think that Wiped Out by Raven could be labeled as the first speed metal record. Sure, it has some traditional heavy metal songs on it, but Wiped Out was faster than their 1981 debut album. And I think that Raven was the fastest band on earth in 1982, next to Venom that is. So let's listen to Wiped Out by Raven. And in 1983, Jaguar released the heavy slash speed metal album Power Games. And German heavy metal band Accept also recorded some fast songs during the early 80s, like Breaker and Fast as a Shark. And the Anvil also recorded some speed metal songs in the early 80s. And Belgium also had somewhat of a speed metal scene going on in the early 80s, with bands like Crossfire, Killer, Warhead and Acid.
And we also have the band Hellion, and it's said that their vocalist Anne Boleyn came up with the term speed metal. But don't quote me on that. And if you think that all these records had too much of a heavy metal edge, then Exciter definitely took speed metal to the next level with their debut album Heavy Metal Maniac. And the Anthrax debut album Fistful of Metal from 1984 could also fall under the speed metal tag. I think there were several songs throughout the 70s that had some speed metal elements in them like Stone Cold Crazy by Queen and Fireball, Speed King, Hard Loving Man and Highway Star by Deep Purple but also Set Me Free by Sweet and Warrior by Riot but I think that Judas Priest was the band that laid the groundwork for speed metal with songs like Exciter, Dissident Aggressor, Call for the Priest, Stained Class, Tyrant, Running Wild etc. And Rob Halford's vocals set the standard for what speed metal vocals should sound like. And I think that Excited by Judas Priest from 1977 was perhaps the first song that I would label as a speed metal song. But it would take a few years before we saw the first speed metal records being released. And Ravens Wiped Out and Jaguars Power Games were good examples of this. And we also have Acid and their first two records, Acid and Maniac, both released in 1983. And then Exciter released Heavy Metal Maniac, Violence and Force, and Long Live the Loud in 83, 84 and 85. And if I was forced to name one defining speed metal record, it has to be Heavy Metal Maniac by Exciter. They are the first band that comes to mind when I hear the term speed metal, since they were one of the few bands that kept playing speed metal when most other bands moved on towards other genres. And to some degree, speed metal was a precursor to thrash, so when thrash metal started to take over in the mid 80s, speed metal was brushed aside. But there were of course several bands that played speed metal in the mid 80s, like Agent Steel, Hellstar and Liege Lord for example. But the genre was perhaps most popular in Germany during the mid 80s, with bands like Running Wild, Halloween, Vectum, Living Death, Gravedigger, Angel Dust, Rage and Blind Guardian all playing some sort of speed metal early on, before several of them moved on towards a more melodic power metal sound. And if you guys are still confused about the difference between speed and thrash metal, I'll link my video on that on the end screen of this video. And check out my metal playlists on Spotify if you're interested in listening to some more speed metal. And join my Discord server, it's linked down below, if you want to contribute to these videos by recommending bands and such. And don't forget to destroy that like button, subscribe and hit that bell icon so you get notified the next time I upload a video. And thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye bye.